In this video with the Onking, I'm going to show you one of the basics, how to backup and how to restore from backup. I have done this many, many times and therefore I highly recommend you learn how to do it. Okay, one of the very basics of Onking. I'm surprised how many people don't actually know how to do this, so I'm going to show you how. There's multiple ways to do it, uh, uh, how to backup. The first is to backup just a deck. For example, if you don't care about this class's deck, but you really care about this other deck, then you can go here and export, and the important part is if you're backing up, you want to include the scheduling and the media. And you can see here it's chosen an A package, that means uh, it's just the deck. So I'm going to hit export, I've actually already exported it here just to save time to this deck. You can see it's called Onking A package. Now if you wanted to back up the whole thing, you could drag this into there so that it's all one deck, or Let's drag that back out. If you have decks like this and you have multiple of them, you can export the whole collection. Uh, sorry, I should do that slower. File, export, uh, and then you can do the coal package. That's the collection package. Uh, and I'm gonna show you basically what happens when we import these. So I'm going to delete this. <laughs> if you were really mad about Anki one day and decided to give up on it, you deleted your deck and then you realized two minutes later that was a bad, bad idea. Well, you could just click on the deck, re-import it. It's gonna put it back in there with its scheduling and all the media and everything that you have. So that's uh, uh, an important, <laughs> important thing. There you go, see, everything is back to normal, all good and happy. Now, if we did the coal package, I'm going to delete this one, and I'm going to delete this one. All right, so we got nothing. We were really stupid. We deleted everything. You can click on this one. It's going to import everything, and it's going to say, hey, we're going to overwrite the existing collection. Uh, and so I'll show you. If you, Had you created a new deck and put new cards in there like this, it's actually going to delete that, so just as an FYI. Uh, and it's going to replace it with everything that was there in this uh, package. So now everything looks good. So that's one way to back up. Uh, the other way, and this is this is a good way to, I, I would highly recommend keeping something like this on a, a internet drive or an external hard drive or something like that because the one that's stored on your computer every time you sync or every time you open and close Anki, uh, I'm going to click open, upload to the web here, uh, it is going to back up. So as you can see, it is 8.03 p.m. and we just created a backup by syncing. So again, I'm going to delete this deck so that you can see uh, what happens. And I am now going to go to File, Switch Profile, and it's going to sync there for me uh, again at 8.03. So this is actually creating a backup here, just as an FYI when we go back in. And I'm going to, as long as I'm on that profile, I'm going to click Open Backup. And it's going to say, do you want to replace? Yeah, we do. Now, remember, there was two at 8.03. There was the one when we just barely closed it. Uh, that's not the one we want. That's the one after we made our bad decisions and we deleted everything. This is the one we want at 8.03, or I synced it just previously at 8.02. So I'm going to click on 8.03. I'm going to click Open, and it's going to say OK, and it's going to reopen, and you can see everything is back there again. So those are the quick and dirty ways to backup and restore from backup. Thanks for learning with The On King. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel here as well as follow us on Facebook, Instagram, or Patreon. That is at OnKingMed. Also feel free to reach out via email or check out our website, OnKingMed.com, for more tips and tricks.